what's going on everybody got another video here for you uh, this video we just got one problem to work solving the quadratic equation by completing the square I know everybody likes to do the quadratic formula but I think completing the square is quicker uh, so I picked this one because we're going to end up with fractions everybody's favorite all right so remember you've got you've got x squared minus 3x Oop, I'm sorry leave a space equals 5 so you take the constant term and you got to move it to the other side and then what we what we do is we take the middle term the 3 and we half it so you take the 3 and you half it now remember halving it is also the same thing is multiplying by a half so you take the middle term half it multiply it by one half however you want to do it and it doesn't matter if you take the minus sign with it or not because you're going to end up squaring it anyway and then you're going to get positive all right so we took the middle term we halved it and that gives us three halves and then you have to square it so three squared is nine two squared is four and so that's plus nine over four and since we added 9 over 4 to this side, we have to add 9 over 4 to the other side. All right, so now what's, what happens here is when we complete the square, the left-hand side becomes a perfect square trinomial, and it factors into this, parentheses squared. Now, let me show you the easiest way to do this. All right, look at the first term. What's the square root of x squared? x look at the last term what's the square root of nine fourths three halves and then what's the sign in the middle the minus so it's the square root of the first term square root of the last term and then this sign goes in between and then this is going to be what is that 29 over 4 remember look that's 5 over 1 get a common denominator all right so now we square root both sides so that's x minus three halves equals plus or minus the square root of 29 over 2. the square root of 29 is just square root of 29 you can't simplify that any and then the square root of 4 is 2. and then we add the three halves to both sides and we get x is equal to three halves plus or minus the square root of 29 over 2 and there's your answer and if you want to you can write it plus or minus the square root of 29 all over 2 you can write it either way if you're in my class I don't care if you have a picky teacher find out how they want you to write it all right but yeah that's it that's the video that's how easy it is all right hope you enjoyed it hope you learned something check out my other videos give me a like share subscribe comment and I will see y'all in the next one. Later.